क्वेश्चन नंबर थ्री अफवर्ड सर्कल ऑफ रेडियस वन हैज इक्वेशन y is equal to 1 minus x square square root for x is less or equal to 1 and greater or equal to 0 which means that definite integral from 0 to 1 1 minus x square square root dx is equal to pi divided by 4 for n is equal to 4 Approximate the definite integral on the left side means y star divided by trapezoidal rule that equal is left side का जो answer आएगा by trapezoidal rule ये equal हो जाएगा right side इसी right side से when pi is equal to three point one अगर आप यहाँ पे pi की जगह three point one put करें देखिए यहाँ पे क्वार्टर सर्कल क्वार्टर सर्कल किसे कहते हैं अगर हम किसी भी सर्कल को फोर इक्वल पार्ट में डिवाइड करें तो ईच पार्ट को हम कहते हैं क्वार्टर ऑफ सर्कल यहाँ पे हमारे पास है डिफरेंट इंटीग्रल गेवन गेवन डिफरेंट इंटीग्रल है इंटीग्रेशन फ्रॉम जीरो टू वन One minus x square square root d x. यहाँ पे a की जगह zero है. Lower limit of integration is zero, so a is equal to zero. Upper limit of integration is one, so b is one. Function is if of x. Is equal to one minus x square square root and n is equal to four. Now trapezoidal rule. Now trapezoidal rule for n is equal to four. Trapezoidal rule for is equal to four a integration from a to b f of x d x is equal to one divided by two del x n to f of x naught plus f of x four plus two times f of x one plus f of x two plus f of x three. This is called the trapezoidal rule. Say this is equation T. Here we n our pass is four. So this is we have to four to go. So f of x naught plus f of x four. This four is here. Plus two if of x one if of x two plus if of x three already आप में हमने if of x four लिखा है अभी हमारे पास del x की वैल्यू del x is equal to b minus a divided by n तो क्या आ जाएगा b की जगह one minus a which is zero divided by n n is 4 so 1 minus 0 is 1 divided by 4 delta x is equal to 1 divided by 4 now x n is equal to x naught plus n delta x x naught is the Initial point which is zero, so I have to make it by x naught to the power zero plus a delta x to the power. We have made it by one divided by four. So what will happen? X n is equal to one divided by four n. Now this is x n's value. If of x is 
value on our class A, 1 minus f of x value on our class A, 1 minus x square square root. So, what do you x ki jada, x and likhi to ya jayega, f of x n is equal to 1 minus x n square square root. Abhi, x n ki jada, 1 divided by 4 and ya ke likhi to ya jayega, 1 minus 1 divided by 4 n all square square root. So, what is 1 minus 1 square is 1 divided by 4 square is 16 and square is n square square root. Now, here we LCM le 16 is the LCM. So, 16 ko 1 ke saar multiply kare to a jayega 16 minus n square square root this is the value of f of x n say this is equation 1 ab humne f of x naught se lekar f of x 4 tak value humne yahan se find karna hai humne yahan pe n ki jagah 0 put karenge to hamare paas aa jayega f of x naught then n ki jagah 1 to hamare paas aa jayega f of x1 then n ki jagah 2 to hamare paas aa jayega f of x2 n ki jagah 3 to hamare paas aa jayega f of x3 last mein n is equal to 4 to hamare paas aa jayega f of x4 so put n is equal to put n is equal to 0 and equation 1 to kya jayega f x 0 is equal to 16 minus 0 square divided by 16 square root to kya jayega 16 minus 0 divided by 16 16 minus 0 is 16 divided by 16 all square root to ye dono cancel ho jayega aa jayega 1 square root which is equal to f of x naught is equal to 1 ek value humne find kiya f of x naught ki value jo ki hamare paas aa gaya 1 now put n is equal to 1 in equation 1 put n is 1 for n is equal to 1 and equation 1 to kya jayega if of x n n ki jaga 1 ya kya jayega 16 minus 1 square divided by 16 all square root to kya jayega 16 minus 1 divided by 16 all square root 16 minus 1 as 15 divided by 16 for square root. Abhi 15 ko 16 per divide kare. 15 ko 16 per divide kare. Jo value da jaye. Isi ka square root le. To ya maay paas a jayega. 0.9 0.9682 So if of x1 is equal to 0.9682 Now for n is equal to For n is equal to 2 in equation number 1 Kya jayega for n is equal to 2 in equation 1 To a jayega if of x2 is equal to 16 minus 2 square divided by 16 all square root. So, I have 16 minus 2 to the 4 divided by 16 all square root. 16 minus 4 is 12 divided by 16 all square root. 12 ko 
16 पे डिवाइड करें जो आंसर आ जाए इसका स्क्वायर रूट ले तो इससे हमारे पास आ जाएगा 0.8660 so this is the value of f of x 2 now put n is equal to 3 and future 1 so my pass is equal to 3 and future 1 so this is the value of f of x 3 is equal to 16 minus x to the 3 for 3 square divided by 16 for square root to add 16 minus 9 divided by 16 for square root 16 minus 9 is 7 divided by 16 for square root and you say what 16 पर डिवाइड करें जो आंसर आ जाए इसका स्क्वायर रूट ले तो हमारे पास आ जाएगा 0.661461 तो ए पर x3 is equal to 0 0.661 दिस इज द वैल्यू ऑफ ए पर x3 लास्ट वन हम ने फाइंड करना है फॉर x4 सो so, पुट n is equal to पुट n is equal to 4 and future 1 तो हमारे पास आ जाएगा इफ ऑफ x4 is equal to 16 minus 4 square divided by 16 4 square is 16 minus 16 divided by 16 is 0 so 0 divided by 16 is 0 and 0 by square root b le to my pass a jayega 0 ab ye tamam values if of x not se le to if of x4 ka equation number p mein put kare sad del x ki value my pass ye 1 divided by 4 put all values put all values and equation P to kya jayega to kya jayega 1 divided by 2 delta x ki value of my pass is 1 divided by 4 if of x max ki value of my pass is 1 plus if of x4 ki value of my pass is 0 plus 2 times of if of x1 which is equal to 0 0.9684 plus if of x2 which is 0 0.8760 plus if of x3 which is 0 0.6 अब इन तीनों नंबर्स को एड करें तो हमारे पास आ जाएगा 1 into 1 is 1 divided by 2 for the 8 1 plus 0 is 1 plus 2 इन तीनों नंबर्स को प्लस करें तो हमारे पास आ जाएगा 2.2.4 2 point, 2 point four अब इसी नंबर के साथ 2 मल्टीप्लाई करें तो हमारे पास आ जाएगा 1 डिवाइड बाय 8 1 प्लस इसी नंबर के साथ 2 मल्टीप्लाई करें तो हमारे पास आ जाएगा 4.9912 के साथ 1 ऐड करें तो हमारे पास आ जाएगा 1 डिवाइड इसी को एड पी डिवाइड करें तो हमारे पास आ जाएगा 0 0.7 4 8 9 7 
let's say equation one, and this is the approximate value of the integral from zero to one, one minus x square square root d x, which is equal to zero point seven four eight nine. अभी हमने इसका राइट साइड डिफाइन करना है राइट साइड हमारे पास है फाइव डिवाइड बाई फोर इसको हम साल करेंगे और देखेंगे क्या इसका जो आंसर है क्या ये लेफ्ट साइड से अप्रोक्सीमेटली इक्वल है कि नहीं तो टेकिंग राइट हैंड साइड विच इज इक्वल टू फाइव डिवाइड बाई फोर पाइव की वैल्यू हमारे पास जेवल जो है वो हमारे पास है थ्री पॉइंट वन तो थ्री पॉइंट वन डिवाइड बाय फोर थ्री पॉइंट वन डिवाइड बाय फोर इससे हमारे पास आ जाएगा जीरो पॉइंट सेवन सेवन फाइव सेवन डिसेल इक्वेशन टू Now from one and two, देखिए यहाँ पे अगर हम इसको round करें तो ये भी हमारे पास है point seven, ये भी हमारे पास है point seven. यहाँ पे हम लिख देते हैं from equation one and equation two, it is approximately equal to integration from zero to one, one minus x square square root d. Question number four: A final circle of radius one has the equation y is equal to one minus x square square root, where x and z are equal to one and y are equal to zero, which means that integration from zero to one. One minus x square square root dx is equal to pi divided by four. Means we are n is equal to four. This ka jo answer aega, this ka matlab ki ye dono equal honge. Four n is equal to four. Approximate the different integral on the left side by Simpson rule. Then equal. ये लेफ्ट साइड सेमसन रूल पे साल करें इसका जो आंसर आएगा इज इक्वल ही इक्वल होगा द राइट साइड पे जो है व्हेन पुट वी पुट पाई इज इक्वल टू 3.1 नाउ गिवन डिफरेंट इंटीग्रल इज इंटीग्रेशन फ्रॉम 0 टू 1 1 माइनस x स्क्वायर स्क्वायर root d x where x is equal to 4 humne yahan pe left side ko liya different integral jo ki left side pe hamare paas hai integration from 0 to 1 1 minus x square square root dx aur n ki value hamare paas hai 4 here Here, lower limit of integration is zero, so a is equal to zero. Upper limit of integration is one, so b is one. The function is if of x is equal to one minus x square square root a is equal to Four. Now Samson rule. Now Samson rule for n is equal to four. For n is equal to four, a integration from a to b equal to x d x is equal to 
1 divided by 3 then x a2 if of x not plus if of x2 a to 4 which is equal to 2 for the 8 so I am saying Samson rule to add the point of nice of the score or increase if of x1 plus if of x3 plus if of x5 plus if of x7 GMR was odd numbers are right. A plus 2 times of E1 increase in F of X2 plus F of X4 plus F of X6. Say this is equation P. I mean, delta rule we have class delta x is equal to b minus a divided by 2 n so kya jayega b ki jaga 1 minus 0 divided by 2 n to 4 so kya jayega 1 divided by a so delta x is equal to 1 divided by a. This is the value of delta x. Now, x n, now x n is equal to x naught plus n n to delta x. So, kya jayega? x naught to jaga 0. So, kya jayega? x n is equal to 0 plus function में put कर दो हमारे पास आ जाएगा if of x if of x is equal to 1 minus x square square root तो क्या आ जाएगा x की जगह x n तो आ जाएगा if of x n is equal to 1 minus x n square और साथ में Root. अभी x n की जगह 1 divided by a के किया जाएगा 1 minus 1 divided by a n all square साथ में square root तो क्या जाएगा 1 minus 1 divided by 64 and square अब यहां पे LCM ले किया जाएगा 64 एस का एलसीएम तो आ जाएगा 64 को 1 के साथ मल्टीप्लाई करें तो आ जाएगा 64 माइनस एक्स स्क्वायर स्क्वायर रूट से दिस इज इक्वेशन 1 अभी हमने ये तमाम वैल्यूज इफ ऑफ एक्स नॉट से लेकर इफ ऑफ एक्स एट तक यहां से फाइन करना है हमने यहां पे n की वैल्यू पुट करना है सो पुट n is equal to 0 पुट n is equal to 0 in equation 1 तो क्या आ जाएगा if of x naught is equal to 64 minus 0 square divided by 64 square root तो क्या आ जाएगा 64 minus 0 divided by 64 64 minus 0 है 64 divided by 64 ये दोनों cancel तो आ जाएगा 1 square root तो एक बार x नार एक बार square root एक equal to 1 तो एक बार x नार 
is equal to 1. Put n is equal to 1 in equation 1. Put n is equal to 1. So, what is the equation 1? Then? f of x1 is equal to 64 minus 1 square divided by 64 is equal to 64 minus 1 divided by 64 61 minus 1 is 63 divided by 64 square root 63 divided by 64 and divide by जो आंसर आ जाए इसका स्क्वायर रूट ले तो ये हमारे पास आ जाएगा 0 0.9928 दिस इज द वैल्यू ऑफ इफ ऑफ x1 फॉर n इज इक्वल टू फॉर n इज इक्वल टू 2 and equation 1 to so, kya jayega f of x 2 is equal to 64 minus n n ki jaga 2 so 2 square divided by 64 square root to so, kya jayega 64 minus 2 to the 4 divided by 64 64 minus 4 and 60 divided by 64 square root 64 64 pe divide kare aur jo answer aa jaye iska square root le to isse hamare paas aa jayega if of x2 is 0.96 a to this is the value of if of x2 for n is equal to 3 and equation 1 to so kya jayega if of x3 is equal to 64 minus 3 square divided by 64 all square root to so kya jayega 64 minus 9 divided by 64 square root 64 से 9 minus करें तो इसे हमारे पास आ जाएगा 55 divided by 64 square root अभी 55 को 64 पे divided करें जो answer आ जाए इसका square root ले तो इसे हमारे पास आ जाएगा 0.92 7 0 ठीक है दिस इज द वैल्यू ऑफ इफ ऑफ x 3 नाउ पुट n इज इक्वल टू 4 एंड इक्वेशन 1 तो क्या आ जाएगा पुट n इज इक्वल टू 4 एंड इक्वेशन 1 पुट n इज इक्वल टू 4 एंड इक्वेशन 1 तो हमारे पास आ जाएगा if of x4 is equal to 64 minus n square for square divided by 64. 64 minus 4 for the 16 for 64 minus 16 divided by 64. 64 say 16 माइनस करें तो इससे हमारे पास आ जाएगा 48 48 डिवाइड बाय 64 स्क्वायर रूट 48 को 64 पे डिवाइड करें जो आंसर आ जाए इसका स्क्वायर रूट ले तो इससे हमारे पास आ जाएगा 0.8 this is the value of if of x4. For n is equal to 5 and equation 1, to kya jayega? If of x5 is equal to 60 
4 minus 5 square divided by 64. 64 minus 5 square is 25 divided by 64. 64 say 25 minus kare Krishna Maya Pasa Jaiga 39 divided by 64 square root. 39 to 64 pe divide kare Pir jo answer ajai iska square root le to is a my pass ajai ga 0 0.7 and this is the value of f of x5. Now put n is equal to 6 and equation 1. Put n is equal to 6 and equation 1. So, kya jayega? f of x6 is equal to 64 minus 6 square divided by 64. Kya jayega? 64 minus 36 divided by 64. 64 minus 36 is se amaray pas a jayega. 28 divided by 64. 28 divided by 64 square root. So, kya jayega? If one x says 28 to 64 pe divide kare, jo answer a jaye, iska square root le, to ye a jayega 0.6 this is the value of f of x6. So, kya jayega? Abhi hamne f of x7, f of x8, hamne find karna hai. Put n is equal to, put n is equal to 7 and equation 1. So, kya jayega? f of x7 is equal to 64 minus n is equal to 7 square divided by 64 square root. So, kya jayega? 64 minus 7 square is 49 divided by 64 square root. 64 minus 49 is the amount of 15 divided by 64 square root to a jayega if of x7 15 ko 64 pe divide kare jo answer a jayega is ka square root le to ye a jayega 0 0.4841 and this is the value of if of x7 last one thumbnail if of x8 point karna hai so put n is equal to put n is equal to 8 and equation 1 to kya jayega if of x8 is equal to 64 minus n square divided by 64 64 minus n square is divided by 64 ye dono cancel to a jayega 0 divided by 64 so if of x n is equal to 0 tamam values humne find ki abhi values equation p me put kar put all values put all these values and equation P साथ में del x की वैल्यू भी हमने फाइंड किया है जो कि हमारे पास है y divided by x और ये तमाम वैल्यूज इक्वेशन नंबर P में पुट करें तो क्या जाएगा तो क्या जाएगा अब ये तमाम वैल्यूज इक्वेशन P में पुट कर हमारे पास आ जाएगा इंटीग्रेशन फ्रॉम is equal to 
equal to 1 divided by 3 delta x t value 1 divided by f f of x naught t value of our pass a 1 plus f of x to pose of a t value of our pass a 0 plus 4 times the f of x 1 t value of our pass a 0 0.9 
divided by 4, 3.1 पॉइंट वन को फोर पे डिवाइड करें तो इससे हमारे पास आ जाएगा जीरो पॉइंट सेवन सेवन फाइव से दिस इज इक्वेशन टू प्राइम इक्वेशन वन एंड इक्वेशन टू यू सी दैट दीज टू वैल्यूज आर अप्रोक्सीमेटली इक्वल सो इंटेग्रल फ्रॉम जीरो टू वन वन माइनस एक्स स्क्वेयर स्क्वेयर ऑफ डी एक्स एंड अप्रोक्सीमेटली इक्वल टू पाई डिवाइड बाई फोर 